granite soup or peanut soup as we all say is one of my children's favorites they love it with their white rice their yams or rice balls today i bring to you my peanut soup recipe so i have my pudria which i believe is the oxtail yes and it's dried because i got it from ghana and this is also the kutuje the cow food also dried and this is the cow skin yes also dried all from ghana i welcome you all back to my channel if today is your first time passing by a warm aqua bath to you so i've washed everything nicely and it goes in my pots i add enough water yes i'm going to bring it to a boil it's very very hard it takes about two hours to cook that oh yes so i have my tomato puree my peanut butter this is our second ingredient so we are going to cook that one as well and this is how i'm going to do mine you see the oil i don't need it so i'm going to pour everything out before i start with my cooking of my peanut butter so here you go the oil has been poured out and i'll put that one aside so in my pot i'm going to put enough peanut butter that i want bring it to a smooth liquid then off it goes on my stove i'll cook it for 20 minutes once again a warm aquaba to you if today is your first time passing by my name is emelda please feel free to subscribe and join this amazing and wonderful family to my old subscribers i love you all so much and to my new subscribers who just joined this channel god bless you so i will add two tablespoons of tomato puree in then off it goes on my stove my kotoje and cow food is doing well so i will stir and stir till everything is cooked nicely and it took me about 20 to 30 minutes and it was okay for me so you see we are getting there yeah i because i pour the oil you won't see too much oil on the surface but if you are doing yours and you don't pour the oil out then you all that oil will still come back on the surface of your peanuts so it's ready for me i will take it out put it aside then concentrate on our meat and it has cooked for about one and a half hours now so since we are preparing peanut soup it's okay for me so i will add in my smoked chicken yes my children love the chicken so i'll add in my one dice onions as well stir very nicely add one teaspoon tomato puree my three homemade ginger and garlic paste then mix everything together at this point uh, 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 uh. the flavor that is coming from my kitchen is so amazing i'm going to use one onga i'm not using too much salty things because with peanut butter if you don't take care your soup will be very salty and you cannot enjoy so i've already cooked my turkey berry one red and one white onion with my pepper i'm going to blend it and now my peanut butter i'm going to add enough water then mix it to bring it a smooth liquid as gain the pot is too small so i'm going to transfer it in this bowl please don't forget to subscribe if you've not done so and also give me a thumb up please thank you now look at our meat mm -mm -mm -mm. the flavor the oh it's not so good and it tastes so good oh yes i took one and i tasted it you know me <laughs> so now this is how i'm doing my peanut butter after mixing it or after bringing it to a liquid yeah i save it because 
I didn't make it myself so I want to know if there is any chaff or anything as you can see you see yes so I always save it before so this is how I do my and looking so good at this stage yes so I will bring in my techy berry blind poured in rinse my blender a little bit then pour it in as well and this is enough soup for me now so i will cover it and bring it to a boil when your soup is coming up like this you need to slice the laid on top of your pot like the way you see mine yes at this stage it's looking very nice we are almost done yes and look at that oil it was smelling so good the children can't wait you know so i will give it a quick stir then bring in my dry fish oh yes i'm adding in dry fish so this is my micro and my tilapia which is the aperture the aperture i did it myself one of these days i will bring the recipe to you but the micro the recipe is on the channel i will link the video in the description box if you've not seen it and the ajain is also from ghana and look at that small ones mm -hmm. it makes the soup smell so good so i never been it i added it <laughs> so at this stage our soup is doing good and i cooked this for 45 minutes and it's ready we enjoyed it with our mood too thank you so much for being with me today please try your hands on it and you will love it and look at the oil god bless you Mwah.